Well, in the next installment of our series with College Football Hall of Famer Eric Crouch, the former Husker reflects on his goal line to goal line run against Missouri. Although fourth ranked NU was up 16 to 3 late in the third quarter at Missouri in 2001, it wasn't until Eric Crouch's school record setting 95 yard touchdown run that Husker fans could breathe easier that late September day in Columbia. He's on the way! Football is the ultimate team sport. I mean, I had guys working for me, you know. It stemmed from being a great teammate and having pe people go fight for you, your teammates. And I had a lot of that. After that touchdown, the Big Red would go on to outscore the Tigers 14 to nothing in the fourth quarter. Touchdown, Eric Crouch. Capping off a convincing 36 to three win. Nebraska's 23rd straight victory over Mizzou. It was fun because uh, that game was so tight. And after that, man, it was like the game, it, it was really like the game was over. I mean, it just took the wind right out of their sail. Kind of funny just, just to go back and watch that and listen to what their coaches were saying after the game. Crouch racked up what was then a career-high 311 total yards of offense that day and vaulted himself into one of the front runners for the Heisman Trophy. Have you ever been more physically exhausted after a single play than that? <laughs> that was pretty physically ex exhausting. That may be one of the most unreal runs I have ever seen. If you go back and look at that play, everybody's still working. And uh, even Wilson Thomas, who you know I was supposed to throw the football to, and I kind of looked, and I don't know if Wilson was ready, or maybe I just didn't quite. I had somebody on me, but he almost beat me to the end zone and uh, show, showed that Wilson could really run, you know. Brings back some good memories. And in part four of our series, the play that arguably put the cherry on top to Crouch's 2001 Heisman season, Black 41 flash reverse against Oklahoma.